My name is Ken Gardner. I'm 64 years old. A year ago, heart failure hit me really hard. I was dying. I knew I was dying. I felt it. On top of the heart failure bad and getting the heart pump, getting on the transplant list, I had cancer. Five months into this, I had cancer. We took care of that. We got me cancer free. And then the tr heart transplant comes in, the donor heart comes in. You take out the pacemaker, you take out the pump, out the drive line. I mean, the whole concept that's keeping you alive to get rid of those things that had been keeping me alive that I'd been struggling with for a few years. What a relief, what a, what a miracle actually. I can swim, I can uh, start getting active and I feel so much stronger and I can take a bath, I can take a shower, you know, before you couldn't because you couldn't short out the, the battery pack and the power source. When this hits you, it changes your perspective I'm going to take better care of this heart than I did my own, my first one. Somebody's looking out for me. And this donor heart is the biggest thing, is a wonderful thing, and of course I'm the biggest fan. I think, this is a little corny and we can't speculate, but the new donor heart has made me very sensitive. And whoever this donor is that gave their sacrifice,